Welcome to part two of my beginner's guide. Now in this part, the difficulty is gonna ramp up. So just be aware of that. And if you do need to level outside of the guide, feel free to go and do some strikes or something. In this part of the guide, we're going to be going to Titan. So click on the blue planet on your guide. Take it all in because this planet is rumored to be destroyed in the next DLC. Anyway, run into this building and on the right, you're gonna meet Sloane. Speak to her and she'll have a mission for you. Pick that up straight away. And the same as the EDZ, remember pick up some bounties just because they're a passive addition and they will grind you a bit of loot. Also, make sure to equip your sparrow you unlocked from last episode. Right, open your director and we're going to fast travel to the other location on Titan. Now we're going to begin one of the harder quests on Titan, it's known as the enemy of my enemy. This is an exotic quest that at the end of the whole quest you will be granted the Rat King, but right now we're just going to be doing the base quest and the difficulty will be ramping up quite a bit in this episode, so try and follow along, but if you need to level up, always feel free to go back and do that. So follow the grey marker, if you get lost open your ghost and the grey marker will come back until you get to this room. Now what's going to happen here is we're going to enter a respawn restricted zone. This basically means what it says on the tin really, you can't respawn so just pay close attention and wipe each wave of hive and then once you've done this part you'll have to move to another area. Now at this area you have to run to this door, hack the door and then just survive. It basically, I think you just have to sit here for about a minute, so hack that door, kill all the enemies that come at you, and eventually you'll be able to escape. Once you've escaped, you'll have a second quest step. All you need to do is go to Sloane and she'll talk to you about doing the second part of the quest. Yet again, open your director, teleport to the rig, and make your way over to the flag to start the adventure. This part shouldn't be as hard, you can just run all the way to the end, and then you'll get the third quest step to drop. In the third part of the activity, conserve heavy ammo and then at the end, unload all of your heavy ammo on the servitor. This should just about one phase him. So throughout this quest, we've actually been following this fallen captain. And if you kill the knight at the end, we have a little bit of uh, Easter egg slash uh, foreshadowing. The captain won't actually kill you and will actually give you the generator. So just ignore him, he'll teleport away and you'll get a little bit of cool dialogue. You'll get the exotic quest for the Rat King, then return to Sloane. He will have a legendary engram for you. To decrypt this, return to the tower and you're going to meet a bloke called Master Rahul. Then equip your gear and this should complete the quest to get you past 820 power. From here you can have a go at doing the Rat King exotic quest or wait for my next video where I'm going to cover Nessus and how to do some of the quests on there. But apart from that, thank you so much for watching and goodbye.